There is a time when you have to leave your emotions and use your intellect. In the Quran, God reprimands those around. who don't use their intellect. God no, says, in, no, 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 think, think, think. Use no, 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 with your emotions, Andrew, with your emotions, you can worship a banana never. or a bicycle. Never. Not you, some people. But with your intellect, you will never worship a banana no, or a bicycle. Don't say impossible. <laughs> can you love a uh, banana? Yeah. yeah. Do, 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 do you see the point? Not me, but Someone with their emotion, they Andrew, can worship a bike. Have you heard of the Hindus? Hindus, they worship anything. So we're not making stuff up, it's real. Emotion needs to be controlled. Emotion needs to be controlled, guided by the intellect. I think when you start controlling your emotion, yeah, you go farther from your... Guided by the intellect. Otherwise, you can worship a bike. With the emotions, I love this bike so much, so beautiful, so nice, let me worship it. Exactly. But intellect will tell you, this bike is not worthy of worship. Why? This is about the emotional intelligence, but the emotional intelligence to win it is not like it's coming. Did you, did, you hear the, did you hear the question? Why do some people worship idols? Is it emotions or intellect? No, no, emotion should be there, but it needs to be controlled. No one will you, forgive you, somebody who doesn't know what means forgiveness. You know what? You've made a brilliant point though. I agree with you. Do you know when Prophet Muhammad Islam, when he was persecuted and oppressed for so many years, and when he came as a conqueror, and now he came, all his enemies who oppressed him are there. They're saying like, oh, Muhammad is now going to kill us all. He's, because by justice, we should be all wiped out and killed. Do you know what he did? Amnesty. He forgave them. That's true. That's, that's it. That's, that's, it. It. that's it. Prophet Muhammad that's lesson for you. That's it. That's it. To have a power in your forgiveness, that's a power. You know? yes. That is why I'm asking you to read like more about him. They are not speaking all together because they are upset. But the power is inside. Yeah, yeah. You read more about his life and you learn more and more about him. But yeah, but yeah. But why I'm not okay with the intelligence? The intelligence is If you're open minded, yeah. when you study life with the public yeah. mind, you only grow up. I'm telling you this. No, she already said she loves Prophet Muhammad in the very beginning. You, you love him even more and accept him as a prophet and a messenger. I, 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 I appreciate everyone who comes to speak about the real stuff, yeah, because we are speaking here about God. That's the most important part, you know. Doesn't matter, Jewish, Islamic, it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. We are uh, this. Uh, yeah, your skin is different, but we are the same. We are the same. Yeah. That's, That's what the prophet said but, in his farewell sermon. Yeah, but there is another thing. When you speak from here. From from, me, from your intelligence, because I have friends that they are thinking that they are intelligent, but they are not that intelligent for sure. Because why? Because they are thinking only here with this brain, and here is also. Can I ask you a question? Ego. Can I ask you a question? Yeah. If you're going to apply for a job, one job pays you a lot of money and all the good benefits and a private car and accommodation and so on, yeah. and other job doesn't. If you're going to use your emotion, or are you going to use your intellect? So I choose, uh, you know, money cannot, I cannot play, you know, now I am 31, I'm yourself, yeah, 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 I'm 31 now, you know, so <laughs> maybe when I had 20, I was thinking, oh, money, money, I no. Now I'm 31, so I'm a bit, I was growing a bit, so I'm thinking that the most important part is not to have a lot of uh, money in your pocket, the most important part is to have something in your soul, peace which is in peace. your heart, yeah, exactly, so, yeah, so you would use your, yeah, brain, I, use not my, emotions. I use my brain, that's true, and this part was if, if, if for everyday life yeah. and affairs, yeah. you use your intellect, yeah. is it no more important to about know about God and His correct nature yeah. and correct religion yeah, yeah, yeah. to use this yeah. as well? Yeah, but in the same time, if you're thinking, look, for example, my mom, she's baptized, and she's very, very, very religious, exaggerating with this religion, but myself not. But when she was telling me, go and pray the Nisa for something, I was praying, but it never happens, you know. But when I started to pray differently, like, I didn't speak from here, from what I had in my mind. I was speaking just what I was having here inside of my heart. 
So I was crying, like, oh, God, please, you know? And that was the moment when God listened to me. So he listened what it was from here outside, not from here outside. Oh, here, sorry, sometimes you will see that here is playing someone, and this is the ego. Ego is a mad part. The Satan we agree says, there. We have to get rid of, of our ego. ego. Yeah. This is the ego. Sincerely, that's, yeah. what, that's what, in fact, you are actually helping us to explain to you even better what the submission to God is. Submission to God is with all your heart. Yeah. Sincere submission. Yeah, yeah, sincere, of course. Well. That is yeah, yeah. Anyway, and another thing that I want to tell you, I, do, I like to speak with people, but another thing that I want to tell you, and this is real, so every time when you are going through your life and you're just working, just work with the truth, with the truth, even if it's your, your truth, your real truth, or it's the truth that you're thinking in it, that's the most important part. Don't lie, just go with the truth in, a, yeah. in the world just, and you will see. We agree there, we agree, changing. we agree. A very good advice. Yeah. Do you read the Quran at all or not? I read just uh, half of it. I have friends who are uh, Muslims. People who reading was, and ask questions. Every time I had problems, for example... Listen was, to it. Listen to the recitation yeah, of the Quran. Yeah, because they, they was giving me their advice and they was writing down their advice because their advice was smarter than the Christian one. For example, I don't remember exactly which was it, but he was telling me how to pray to God to take that... Uh, bad thing from my heart mm. so i say like oh my god you're smarter than us why because you're having the religions the religion here going from the family and i don't know you know it here ourselves we don't know it we know that that's not good that's yeah. a good thing but we don't know it so i think i think precisely. one one last advice i would say listen to the quran being recited in the arabic yeah. and you will see the the peace that you feel in your heart yeah, yeah. yeah that's I have it. I, ha I was here, so I asked my friends to bring me a Quran in the Romanian language. So they give it to me yeah. in my language. But listen to, it, sure. listen to it in the Arabic that it's recited. It's on YouTube, if you, know. if you yeah. listen to it. I think I think you need this more than reasoning yeah. and intellectual discussions. But yeah. if, were, if, if, if it communicates to your heart, yeah. then you know where the truth lies. Just okay? do it. And this is what I'm saying. For example, yeah, I love everyone, I love everything because I'm speaking from my heart. But yeah, sometimes I can be a fool. What's your name? Denise. Hmm? Denise. 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 It's okay. Nice, nice talking to you. Um, you, you know we don't. Um, ah, yeah, okay, good. Right. Uh, yeah, yeah. For example, right. Romanian Christian people they like to hug each other. <laughs> no, you can hug because her and yeah, yep, they like that's to hug each other. They like to <laughs> help each other, you know. But even yeah. like this, they like to touch each other, you know. That's the nice part. No, but in Islam, men do.